real quick heads up on how why um, white paint does not cover. A lot of people go, well, I you know I don't understand you know why the white paint doesn't cover and and all this other stuff and and you know all these different theories and everything. When I explain it to you, um, let's say you go to Home Depot and you get Ultra Pure White from Bear, all right, and you go, man, that stuff doesn't cover at all. Well, you look right here, see what that says, white P, okay, some whites say on it white, and it doesn't have any kind of P or W or base, it doesn't say white base, white P, white W, um, W base, okay, a lot of them to say, okay, what those are, and what this one is, is it's tint base. So that's, and so if you get one that says on it white, a lot of times, and depending on the brand, you got to kind of really search this out. The white, one that says white, you ask them, does it, is it tintable? And they go, no, no, that one you can't tint. It's all white. Those cover better than the ones that say white. Now, there's a way to get these to cover really good too. Okay. Um, and if you're looking to make your house pure white, first of all, if, if somebody comes to me and says, I want my stuff pure white, I tell them, I don't do that, period. And they go, why? Because every white is different. So you can have a pure, pure white from ultra pure white from Bear, and you go to get the same pure white at Vista, and they're going to be different if you go to touch it up. It's not going to be the same color. It's going to be slightly different white. But when you look at the wall, it looks white. So white often is white, even if it's not pure white. So what I use is something slightly off of pure white, and, you know, like white shadow, or something like that and I tell people that's all I use I don't use that I don't use pure white if you want pure white get somebody else to do the job I don't do it and they just look at me and they go well okay well, good no, no what do you do and usually they listen to you but if they don't listen to me then I don't want to do their job because I know what they're like I know what I'm gonna to have to deal with I've been doing this for 35 years when I get somebody like that I know they're gonna be a problem so I just steer away just let somebody else deal with it so anyway but this is how you get your white to cover. Okay, you see you want a really bright white, pure white. You want it to cover. You have them add KX tint to the white. And usually I'll go with a black 0.5 or with uh, two increments of raw umber. So, and then that looks, still looks pure white. You can't really tell the difference, but it's... You know, something like that. I'm just telling you, I usually tell them a little more than that. I'll go to white shadow, a, a, a color white, which is looks white, but it's not white. And the reason is, and I'll tell them, they go, why do you, why won't you use pure white? I want it really, really white. And I'll say, look, if I paint it pure white, it's before I even get done with the job. Just from walking through and touching our hands on it, it's going to be dirty. Do you really want that kind of a maintenance? Or would you just be willing to accept something that looks pure white, that looks the same, but it's not going to get so dirty and be so hard to manage? And that's what I usually explain to them. And 99% of the time they cave, they want me to do the job. So, you know, that's the right way to explain it to somebody. But if you're going to try and get your, if you got to use white, and you're trying to match it, or you're trying to do something, and you want your white to cover, add kx kx is pure white tint okay you add kx to your thing so typically i'll have them put in two to four ounces of kx if the paint company will do it like if i was going to home depot and i was buying ultra pure white from bear i would have them add kx to the white and then that that kx will give it more titanium dioxide to cover you know better one coat that's a little trick. So anyway, that's my heads up on whites and why they don't cover um, because they're white pee. Now, if you get one that says on it white, usually it's that's what they did to it already. They added KX to it, to the, to the formula that makes the white. They added some amount of B. And, and 
and it you can see it's not when you put it next to the ultra pure white or something like that the ultra pure white looks whiter than it but when you paint the whole wall and you you painted one wall ultra pure white you paint the next one the white you're never going to notice the difference you just can't see it but when you go to touch it up you won't touch up so that's the heads up on whites why they don't cover how to get around it do if you're doing your own work at home don't use pure white please use white shadow use swiss coffee some places white shadow is is the best one they have ones that are called whisper white from dun edwards that's a really white white it's almost perfectly pure white but it has enough tint in it to cover and it's going to be a lot easier to cover um you, you know than than um than trying to trying to get a pure white and when you get done it's going to get dirty so fast you're going to be like wow it's already dirty you gotta to touch it you just your fingerprints will show up on it because pure pure white is just too white sorry it is all right talk to you in the next video